Hello, my name is Melissa and I'm a mom to a little boy named Tyler. He is my only child. He's four years old currently and for the first two and a half years of his life, he received early intervention services. We first found out about this program when we were uh, attending ECFE classes, which is early childhood family education classes. He was just a little baby at this time. He was around four months old. The group leader there had noticed some things about Tyler that were different from a typical baby of his age and brought this to our attention. Um, a little background, Tyler had heart surgery when he was just three months old. So I always kind of attributed that to his slow development. like course he can't do tummy time he just had heart surgery and so on Tyler was our first child we really didn't have any benchmarks to compare him to um, but I really do guess that a lot of it was denial on my part knowing and seeing something was definitely off with your child with my child was was very hard to accept for sure I called the number on the back of the brochure the help me grow brochure our ECFE group leader had handed me that brochure about a month prior. It took a lot of time to build up the courage to make that call. Through a lot of tears, I talked to this woman who was the nicest woman on the planet at the time and answered some basic questions about Tyler for her. It was shortly after that that we had our first visit from the assessment team. It was three ladies that came to our home to meet Tyler and to talk to my husband and I. We figured out that Tyler was definitely behind his peers and designed a plan that fit him. And it was for him to focus on mostly weekly physical therapy, which is PT, with some occupational therapy, which is OT, thrown in a couple times a year or two. The coolest thing about it was the team would come to our house to do these reviews and the physical therapy sessions were every Wednesday and she came to our house as well. It was super convenient. They worked around our personal schedules. My husband works nights, I work days. It gets a little crazy. So they were able to work with us and make something convenient for all of us. And for, of course, for Tyler too, not around his nap time, for example. Um, instead of fearing these visits like we, like we did at first, we actually ended up looking forward to them so much. And obviously they've, they've helped tremendously. We learned so many things from our therapist, tricks and exercises that we could practice on our own time and really cool gadgets and tools like homemade trampolines and uh, special sippy cups that we still use to this day. Um, we've also taught others in our community about these exercises and tools and tricks. Um, so we've hopefully benefited someone, someone else's family as well. Um, I found the most benefit in the, the support groups. Uh, there was a parent support group in our community. And if your area has one of these support groups or even the Help Me Grow presence on social media, I strongly suggest taking part in that. It takes a lot of courage to attend your first session um, in a group setting, but I promise you it'll be beneficial. For me, it was simply life-changing. Through the support group I have met, lifelong friends. The bond between mothers and fathers and caregivers of special needs children is like nothing else in the world. I look forward, looked forward to these sessions as much as I did Tyler's physical therapy as PT sessions. So the point of all this, I think, is, is sharing. We learn things from our therapists that we can pass on to others. And I'm so happy to be making this video to share our experience and how positive it was, even though it was really scary at first. I don't know where Tyler and I would be without it. So thank you for your time and have a great day.